dispersion of light in this module you will learn about the dispersion of light sometimes after the rain we see rainbow in the sky it looks spectacular doesn't it do you know how a rainbow is formed a rainbow is formed due to the phenomenon of dispersion of light to understand what dispersion of light is let us perform an activity for the activity you need a prism a white sheet and a cardboard with a small hole at its center place the cardboard at a position such that the sunlight falls directly on it next keep the prism such that the light passing through the hole of the cardboard falls on the surface of the prism at the other end of the prism fix the white sheet as shown as the sunlight passes through the prism you will observe a beautiful band of colors appearing on the white sheet if you look at these colors of the band from the bottom they are in the order violet indigo blue green yellow orange and red this sequence of colors can be remembered by the acronym vibgyo the light coming from the sunlight was white light are you wondering from where this beautiful band of colors appeared actually the white light consists of seven colors namely violet indigo blue green yellow orange and red which we saw as the band of colors when the white light coming from the sunlight falls on the prism it splits this incident white light into its constituent colors the splitting occurs because different colors of the sunlight bend through different angles with respect to the incident ray when they pass through the prism the red light bends the least while the violet bends the most thus the rays of each color emerge along different paths and become distinctly visible thus we are able to see the beautiful band of colors this phenomenon of splitting of white light into its constituent colors through a prism is known as dispersion of light the band of constituent colors is known as spectrum this phenomenon was first discovered by sir isaac newton now that we have understood what dispersion of light is let's understand how it causes the formation of a rainbow a rainbow is generally formed when the sun appears just after it has rained at this time many water droplets are present in the air when the sunlight passes through water droplets in the atmosphere each water droplet acts like a small prism and refracts the incident sunlight as soon as the sunlight enters into the prism that is the drop it splits into its constituent seven colors vibgyo within the drop when this band strikes the other edge of the drop it gets reflected internally towards the first edge of the drop as the band reaches the first edge it gets refracted again and finally comes out of the raindrop this band of colors which finally comes out of the raindrop is what we see as rainbow a rainbow is always formed in the direction opposite to that of the sun thus the appearance of rainbow in the sky is due to the dispersion of sunlight by the water droplets present in the atmosphere dispersion of light not only results in the formation of a rainbow but we can see this effect in our day-to-day -day life as well for example the beautiful band of colors we observe in water fountains soap bubbles and cds are all due to dispersion of light let's recap the white light consists of seven colors namely violet indigo blue green yellow orange and red vibgyo the phenomenon of splitting of white light into its constituent colors through a prism is known as dispersion of light and the band of constituent colors is known as spectrum 
formation of a rainbow and beautiful band of colors observed in water fountains so bubbles cds etc are all due to dispersion of light